seriously? Fucking hell, I smoked so much weed! I took so much cocaine, and I slept with tons of prostitutes. But when I was done, I left the Anne Frank Museum. Then I'm a bit hacked. We do recall later, it gets better. So, so come on, let's, let's keep it safe. Now, what does a black guy and a marble have in common? I don't know, the difference is too great. I haven't come up with anything yet. <laughs> oh god, no, I'm not racist! God, no, no, I'm not racist! No, god, no, my best friend! Well, he's a... Well, he's a racist, isn't he? And, you know, no, one, no one likes him very much, so learn from others. Learn from others. Learn. <laughs> Who here's taken drugs before? <laughs> Just me then, that's fine. <laughs> so who here likes one-liners? <laughs> Check out Tim Vine, fucking <laughs> I just thought one. Fucking really. <laughs> Your mum is so fat, she weighs 22 and a half stone. That's uh, working pro needs what? <laughs> 9 out of 10? 9.5. 9 9.8. <laughs> 9 9 <laughs> so, gay people, eh? Well, he's a racist, isn't he? Let's not, let's not go back to that. Let's just leave that there. What's funny is that when comedians put a twist on the end of their jokes, are going in one direction, all of a sudden they go in another. I was having a wine the other day, and I enjoyed it very much. But the staff at Tesco didn't. No. I don't know what they were doing hanging around my bedroom. I was doing building my bedroom in all six at Tesco. <laughs> but then again, I don't know what Tesco were doing building their store in the Anne Frank Museum. <laughs> Recall. <laughs> Sorry, they caught that.